A lot of us are getting ready to head out into the sun this weekend and beyond. In our Health Watch report, Local 3's Connie Fellman tells us what you should know about melanoma. Melanoma is the deadliest form of skin cancer, claiming the life of one person each and every hour. The longer it takes to diagnose it, the harder it is to stop it. That's why it's so important to know the facts about melanoma. Is this a mole or melanoma? How about this one or this one? Actually, all of these moles are melanoma. Knowing which ones are cancerous could save your life. It is one of the most aggressive cancers on the planet. Nearly 100,000 people will be diagnosed with melanoma this year. What you don't know about it puts you at risk for it. First question, does melanoma mainly affect older people? My daughter, when she was 25, was diagnosed with melanoma. While the average age of diagnosis is 65, melanoma is also the second most commonly diagnosed cancer for people age 15 to 29. But does the color of your skin also matter? Studies show fair-skinned people have a higher risk of developing it. But anyone can get it. Melanoma does not discriminate. But does it only occur on your skin? The doctor that saw me that day uh, noticed a bubble in my left eye. Melanoma can develop anywhere on the body, eyes, scalp, nails, feet, and areas with mucous membranes like your sinuses. The best line of defense, lather up with sunscreen with an SPF of 30 or more every single day. Even on the cloudy days, 80% of the UV rays reach our skin. Getting five or more blistering sunburns between ages 15 and 20 increases your melanoma risk by 80%, and young women especially redheads and blondes, are more at risk. Experts recommend examining your skin head to toe every month, especially looking for any new mole or a change in an existing mole. And if you see something suspicious, you should see a skin specialist right away. And that's your Health Watch. I'm Connie Fellman, Local 3 News.